There's a lot of things in politics that frustrate me, <laughs> but for 40 years uh, on a short list, that is one of them, that uh, the Republicans, at various times they've had control of, uh, of uh, the Senate, sometimes the House and the Senate, sometimes the presidency and the House and the Senate, but regardless, uh, they have always funded our political opponents to the tune of billions of dollars a year. And I never understood why Republicans, uh, when they had the opportunity to uh, stop uh, funding organizations that had a political agenda, and by the way, uh, I don't think conservatives should be getting any political money uh, either. Any organization that has a political agenda, whether they're conservative, moderate, liberal, should not be uh, funded by the, by the taxpayers. And hopefully there is a window now when the American people f know that we have to seriously uh, reduce our spending, that they will focus on uh, organizations that have a uh, uh, political agenda. And while we're talking about serious money, it's not, going, uh, it's not at the level, say, of the entitlement programs, but it could be three, four, five billion dollars a year. We don't know exactly how much is being funded. But the purpose of uh, much of these uh, organizations, their agenda, is to lobby for more government. So if we take away three, four, five billion dollars from these uh, political organizations, they won't have the ability to lobby for a bigger and bigger government. So it's huge going forward that we uh, focus on uh, uh, stopping all taxpayer money going to uh, organizations that have a uh, political agenda.